What is up guys? Welcome to the Big Unbox where we do that small tech and today I am back with another big unboxing for you for the OnePlus 7T and today we're back with a case from UAG. This is going to be the Plasma series. In the past I really like this one. This is going to be $39.99 at least that's what it retails for. I think you get in two different color options. I want this kind of like I guess it's kind of like a smoke color. I can't remember what they call it. Ash man. Let's see. Well, I can't remember what they call it. This is one, I maybe called ice, because actually you can see a little bit of ice. I think the other one's like a smoke color where it's more a little more dark. But I like this one because it's going to show off the back. So you can see you got a your little UAG branding right there. Drop tested. And this is really military style drop protection. That's what the key is for UAG. And I've actually really started to like these particular cases because of the amount of protection you get. And then plus... Honestly, it's not that much more bulk than some of the other cases that you might see on the streets. So this one, to me, is maybe one of the better case companies coming about right now. So you got built for further, but let's say built to go further. Anyways, and then you got a little more information about the actual protection itself. That's pretty much it in terms of presentation. Looks clean. Nice presentation for 40 bucks. What you would expect, let's be honest, that's a pretty expensive case, but... I think this one actually might be for everybody looking for a heavy duty case. There's really not, I don't think there's an OtterBox this, this go around. Use the OtterBox. They skip the T versions of the OnePlus brands, which is a little bit weird. You know, it is what it is, but they usually skip the T. So this might be one of the heavy, heavy boys for the, the case collection. If you guys are looking for some heavy duty protection. Now you can see, I really like the way this one looks. My first impression, it's got nice grip. You can see it's got a hard plastic on the back. It's got a little bit of flex to it. And then it transitions to the bumper part that's got this really nice sleek. It's a, it's a hard plastic, but it's kind of feels soft as well. And then the first thing I noticed, look at those reinforced edges. You can see how much those are reinforced. Top, right there, right there. And then they do the same thing, I believe. Let's check this out on the bottom. So you're getting really nice if you drop it. That's going to be your impact protection where they give you four edge to edges. So if you do drop it, it's definitely going to hit that first. And then you can see right there, that's where you're getting that extra protection for drop protection. So very nicely done. It's got some nice grip too. You can see the little ridges on the sides. That's where it's going to give you the grip on the sides. It's got a nice feel to it. It's got some dimples on the inside, which I didn't notice. Now that's going to give you a... a, a I like this because... You're going to get that clear style look to it, but then you're not going to get the negatives of a clear case. We're not going to get a fingerprint magnet. This is kind of deflect some of those fingerprints, which I really like that. You got a little bit of UAG. Well, it's kind of less a little. It's pretty big, but I don't have a problem with it just because of the design of the case itself. Got some UAG branding right there. Looks pretty clean. And then the most important thing, which we'll check out, and I think hopefully be impressed with this, is the camera protection and a lot of the cases that I've reviewed so far have been lacking the camera protection especially the official official cases from OnePlus which I'm very disappointed about usually I call them all big hits but a lot of them are missing that camera protection for that big cutout right there so let's go and check this one out we'll pop it into place let's do this first you know how we do it look at that silver beauty pop now, does anybody else have this silver beauty is it just me I love the way this thing looks it looks gorgeous to me look at this beautiful wipe it down wipe it down that might be the best looking black dark color foam that I've seen. Just look at that. It's got a shimmer to it, doesn't it? And I'm more of a dark style case or foam guy because I really think they match up with most cases. But this one just looks absolutely gorgeous. As I keep on going on about it, let me know what you guys think about that. You like that black or I guess you guys like the silver or you like that blue. That nebula blue looks good, but I really like this, guys. I'm telling you, check this one out if you have a chance to. And pop it into place. And oh my, that looks gorgeous. What do you see? Look at those dimples. You can just see that kind of waterfall effect on it with the dimples. Looks very nice. Now, the one thing I noticed that's a little bit disappointing. This is one thing I would say. Get it together. You see the OnePlus logo popping through just a little bit. But then you see the UAG branding popping over it. Which it kind of makes it look tacky. So why not put, if you guys know, if they're doing the design of the case push this down a little bit so you can still see the one that's a flaw in my opinion and it's a small one but to me you like this if it's popping through the oneplus logo make this uag a little bit down a little bit so you're getting full now, i might be rapping a little bit too much about that but to me it's just a little bit of a design flaw but you can't see the oneplus at the very bottom looking clean i really do like the way this case feels in the hand it's definitely going to add some more bulk to it but again look at that protection that you're going to get now speaking of protection this is where it comes in handy. Let's check this out. 
look at that camera protection and you can see that reinforcement around all the edges right there that's going to give you that camera protection that not a lot of cases for this oneplus 7t are going to give you and you can see it's a circular fashion but then that reinforcement raises up and then you can see that black border as well so if you do drop it it's definitely going to give you or if you, even if you just put it down you're not going to have to worry about it getting all scratched up where so many other cases that i've reviewed don't have that protection so this one to me is going to be a hit for that alone i'll put a pass on that you know that logo being popped through but you know it is what it is now let's check out the lip because everybody does like a fat lip let me turn the screen on real quick here there we go give you guys a look at this one right here look at that lippage so you can see you're getting nice lip protection it's not crazy i'm rocking a full i'm, I'm rocking the official screen protector the official one plus screen protector now it is compatible i'm squeezing i'm squeezing i'm squeezing i'll turn the screen on in a second but i wanted to show you guys to see if it's popping through i had the spigen version of the uh whatever their tough arm or rugged arm whatever and it was not compatible where this one appears to be full compatible so look at that lip protection you got full edge to edge protection with that screen protector across the board so that's nice full corner protection so if you drop it it's definitely going to hit the screen or not going to hit that screen because really it's such a tight window across all corners that you're good to go so i really liked what they did there with this one very nicely done attention to detail now the button a little bit less clicky and responsive i would like you can see the power buttons right there the volume up and down a little bit tough to press but i think they might get a little bit better once a little bit more better once you start wearing tear into them so you can see the cutout speaker grill power very nicely done looks clean across the board and that's one thing about uag for the most part i think they do a really good job with their actual phones with the actual just fine details now you can see the power button right here and you can see it's got a nice little bridge to it alert slider easy access and you can see right there that's an actual fine detail you can see how it's easy to get to the alert slider with no struggles right to it you don't have to like put your finger all up in it and stuff like that it's like a nice little landing for your finger right there perfectly done so overall guys let me tell you about this one i think this is going to be a hit to me overall you can't get a better constructed case for 40 bucks that's going to give you a really nice protection it's going to add some bulk it's not going to be for everybody who wants the minimalist protection but this is going to be that one case that you're going to get that's going to give you nice protection full edge edge protection and it's compatible at least right now unless it pops through i've had this in the past where i've finished the video up and i've uh, used the case and the screen protector starts popping up but this one appears to be fully compatible so overall i'd say this is going to be a hit let me know what you guys think about this one in the comment section is it a hit is it a miss hit the subscribe button i'll see you guys next time